Thank you guys for tuning in once again, Carpentry or Chris. Stay until the end to find out how you can get in into the Stiletto Hammer giveaway. Enjoy the video. We're using kind of like um, like rebar caps, but for something else on the scaffold. So we're we're hand making these, and I just put the measurements here for me. And I need 25, 24 of these uh, five inch ones. My uh, construction gear muffs. Trust me, these things get loud. Usually I like lifting up the notch right here, so then once I start cutting, it goes automatically right here. Because sometimes if I go here, the blade tends to go somewhere else. I'm gonna cut the lines first, then after I'm gonna cut it all, so then all of it just falling one by one. That way I'm being a little bit more efficient. And let me show you how that goes. Just finishing up all these things. Already know what time it is. It's time to shine right here. So, as you can see, this is all pretty clean. But I gotta stay busy. So, here I am cleaning even more. This is sick. Put this to music. I don't think he stepped out either. That may be the greatest catch I've ever seen. Test number 39. Penalty's declined. The ball to the play. Touchdown. Oh, banding again. Whatever side you're on, you want that side on top. So if I were on the other side, I want this one. Check 
check this out. Three months in. They gave us a radio. Funny thing is they don't know I used to be a security guard, so I know a bunch of terms and codes. And so I say to you, sir. There's a lip on that carpet, someone's gonna have to call that in, get that Some radio etiquette. If you're gonna talk, make sure you're, you're clear in who you're gonna talk to. So for example, hey, this is Chris, I need to talk to so-and-so. Just always make sure to wait until they're done, and then you respond. And then to talk onto it, you just kinda have to press onto this, and then let go of it once you're done because if not you're gonna have an open mic which essentially is the radio is gonna keep on going and it's already turned off so look yeah got a radio just watch out if you guys ever get a radio reach out to sweeper one my code name is sweeper one no, i'm joking project of the day uh, I need to make something that's 38 by 10 I got the measurements this so guys updated to see how that is I'll start cutting and all that I'm learning to just work on one side first I'm gonna fix this side first and then I'm gonna end with this right there torpedo level you put it on top and you look at if it's at the middle, if it's not in the middle, then we have to kind of like lower it or bring it up. Uh, right there. All right, guys. So I'm doing this cut project. I'm almost done. I have I have this already here. I don't know if you guys can see that. How do you have it here? So the issue is when you're an apprentice, everyone's trying to tell you how to do it. Too many chiefs and not too many Indians. Everyone's trying to be a boss and no one's trying to do stuff. So I'm trying to handle this cut as fast as I can so no one tells me what else to do. I'm just trying to handle this my best and uh, let's see how it goes. Keep you guys updated. Alright guys, this is the project that I finished. So I remember I cut the lid really fast and I cut this as well. To protect the uh, fire hydrants of the public won't they? hydrated very important it's a hot day and uh, for me honestly I feel good I've been, I've been drinking a lot of water even when you're not dehydrated just drink some water because if you're dehydrated it's already too late if you have a visor or some, some sort of rag watch this my rag right here oh yeah so to make sure the safety harness you don't want this you want it just tight enough a pressure but you can still put so i'm locked up got my safety harness on yeah i feel like i'm a man Got this to connected into this to the yo-yo. You don't want to watch super fast, it's gonna pull you back very hard. Watch your footing. So this one's 30 feet, so obviously it reaches 30 feet. Well duh. Yeah. So I'm feeling that the yo-yo's pulling me now. So the wind is blowing towards me too, so it's another thing. Oh, it's nice. It's too heavy. Drag it. Found the easier way how to carry this plywood. So, clear your, clear your area first. Elbow, slide it in. Grab it here. Grab the other one here. Only when you're up here on the steel. You gotta set yourself up for success. Finish organizing this wood, covering the elevator shaft. That way people don't, you know, go in there with the same stuff. Yeah. 
We're out here at Oakland Flea Market and just getting some tools. This is another convenient way how to get some cheap tools. They got all kinds of stuff out here. Hey, Mookie. If you know how to bargain right, you'll get the price. Speed squares, other hammers. The main reason I got this one is because it has a clip right there on the top. And then I can put like a radio on there. Other little pockets here too, where I can put other things. Pencils, pens, a belt, good one. And they got me some dart and some flyers. Oh, that's the I on mean. the flea market, reasonable price. And a couple extra long sleeve construction shirts. Very important, very important on a hot day like this in the summer. Other than that, we're good. Saludos, ahí pa. Hola, ¿cómo están? My dad right there. <laughs> That's pretty much it for this week. Now, the Stiletto Hammer Giveaway. You have to email me by no later than April 11th, Sunday, 11.59. And um, email me one number. Choose a number from one to a thousand, okay? Whoever gets the closest number, I will personally email them back and then we'll get into information on how I will send you that stiletto hammer. Also, next week, April 5th on Monday, I will be going to Pleasanton, California out here for the carpenter schooling. So I'm going to teach you guys how to use the record book as a carpenter apprentice, the kind of tools that you need to have as a carpenter apprentice and the tools that I use on a daily basis and that I carry with me. Thank you so much for helping me reach 100 subscribers. Once I reach 1,000 subscribers, I will be giving away either a Occidental bag or a circular saw. The winner will be able to choose. Oh, say less. <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you so much. Thank you for being just uh, supportive of this channel. All the honor and glory be to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Stay motivated. Stay just dedicated, never never give up, work hard, and man, let me tell you, uh, you have that mentality, you'll go very far in life. Dios te bendiga, God bless you, until next time. Hasta luego.